can't you just help me out a little bit on the side, you know? Like a hobby. There is no on the side here, Maria. This is a full-time job. This is not a hobby. You are quite rude. You're a little uncouth. And you are completely disinterested in the past. And you have an unusual talent for making me feel good about myself. But you have the connection. What connection? Family, Randy. Your grandparents came here from Austria. You see, we share the same history. Woman in Gold is a film about a painting. It's a very famous painting by Gustav Klimt, and it was also the subject of a very famous series of lawsuits initiated by Maria Altman, whose aunt is portrayed in the painting, who was upset that during World War II, the painting was stolen from her family by the Nazis, and who initiated these lawsuits to get it back. She hires a young attorney, played by Ryan Reynolds. It's a long shot to get it back, lots of twists and turns. In Austria's case, there's a treaty, so there's no dispute as to what type of law could apply. We recommend opening the can and extracting just the, the one little worm with a pair of tweezers and then quickly closing it shut again. <laughs> the defendants in this case have continuously tried to frustrate our attempts, raising every possible objection, threatening an Armageddon in international relations, but let's put things into perspective here. This is a case of one woman wanting back what is rightfully hers. Mrs. Altman came to America as a young woman in search of peace. Let's give her justice, too. This story, which is a true story, is a really fascinating one. Unfortunately, the film that tells it is only adequate, but there is one excellent aspect to this film, and that is Helen Mirren's performance as Maria Altman, the woman who files the lawsuits. Helen Mirren is expert, these kind of imperious characters. She really has a great time with this one, and she is the real reason to see this film. For the Los Angeles Times, this is Kenneth Turan.